Well, this is our street, Oleander, after I would estimate about six inches of rain in the last five hours. Uh, the entire street, as you can see, is flooded. I'm going to move out to the middle. It's already drained away, but this was underwater. And you can see this is about as close as water ever gets to the front of our house. And it gets about three feet up to that front porch. We're very fortunate to have very good drainage in this particular area. Although I have no idea why people chose to throw out their furniture uh, over the past couple of days. This is going to be an absolute monster to pick up the furniture. But the sun is setting. It's about 7.30 on Memorial Day. And I don't think I can forget this particular Memorial Day. Even our garbage cans are full of water because they were left open. And a beautiful reflection of our home and the palm trees and the water. We see the scaphola reflection in the water. Coming up to our frangipani. Fortunately, the squirrels didn't get into our our mangoes today. There you can see the Duncan. There's a tree in front of it that has two varieties on it. And there's a mango tree to the right of it. And right there we can see the water percolating down into the earth below because at the end of this block <clears throat> we have a protected wetland right at the end of this block as you can see Also, extraordinary pieces of furniture being thrown out. These have been out there for three days. <clears throat> they probably weigh one ton, I would estimate. 